Okay, let's look at number two. So number two is what is a neutral atom? And we can define basically a neutral atom as an atom that has the same amount of protons and electrons. So therefore the charges are, are balanced out, so therefore it's a neutral atom. So I can define this as, oops, sorry, define this as same amount of protons and electrons. So um, that would that would give me a neutral charge. So therefore it becomes a neutral atom. And that's kind of the definition of what a neutral atom is. So as you can see here, um, because we have protons here which are positively charged, so this guy here is positive charged, and electrons are negatively charged. If we have the same amount of both uh, protons and electrons, then therefore we have a neutral charge. So therefore it says here, number of protons equals number of electrons, so the solution here is correct. So for example, in this atom here, which is um, it has four protons and four electrons, so therefore it's a neutral atom here. And if you have an imbalance of them, it could either be a positively charged ion or a negatively charged ion here. So the solution here is correct.